my name is Shotaro Hirase. I'm from the University of Tokyo. I will be, today I will be talking about a unique hybrid population found in an intersectional bomb around Japanese archipelago. First, I will, uh, I will, be, uh, I want to try to begin my talk by describing the historical background of this study. Previous phylogeographic studies suggested that significant genetic divergence between the Sea of Japan and Pacific Ocean population in coastal marine species in the Japanese archipelago, and which were caused by the uh, processing isolation isolation events. And Intertidal Gobi also has uh, two groups, and as you know, I worked um, and I, I have worked on this genetic study of this species. In the previous study, I collected samples around up Japanese archipelago and uh, mitochondrial DNA I have performed. As a result, as you can see, all haplotypes form the two plates. And I also performed Bayesian clustering analysis using microsatellite DNA markers. And the two groups were assigned two genetic clusters suggesting the lack of gene flow. To estimate divergence time, we performed parallel mitogenome sequencing. As a result, 3.7 million years ago, divergence was suggested, and this event, uh, so, and the initial opening of the Sea of Japan was estimated to trigger the genetic divergence. Secondary contact occurred in the northern Japan region, Tohoku region, after the last interglacial period. And considerable admixture was occurred in the subtle population, and most individuals were estimated to be post F2 hybrid. This result suggests that this hybrid population is a novel genetic group derived from the hybridization and in initial phase of hybrid speciation. Homoploid hybrid speciation is a process. It in, is a process by which a novel reproductively isolated group arise through hybridization of the parental genome of without polyploidy. There is growing evidence of homoploid hybrid species in animals. However, in many cases, historical processes towards the generation of hybrid species are complex and unclear. For example, speciation processes of parental species and detailed processes of hybridization were not, were not often estimated. So our system is very simple and so maybe suitable for studying of the onset of hybrid speciation. Because past study based on uh, limited genetic matters, so in this study, we performed large sequencing of steel, uh, steel Japan group and Pacific Ocean group and the context zone. And uh, we studied about genomic divergence between the two groups and gen genomic status of the hybrid population. We performed digital sequencing using high tech. Number of reads per individual was, were uh, ranged 1 million to 8 million reads. SNP detection was done according to this method. First, I talk about genomic divergence between the two groups. I used the two populations of each group and detected 3,800 rows. We concatenated the nucleotides of SNP rows and created neighbor joint trees. As you can see, clear genomic divergence was detected 
and two groups do not share are in 7% SNP locker. We estimate the divergence time using genetic distance and mutation rate. As a result, 2.3 to 5.1 million years ago divergence was suggested, and this result is uh, corresponds to the result of mitogenome. During glacial period, the Sea of Japan was characterized by colder temperature and lower salinity because of the closing of the southern strait with cold fresh water and frog river. So adaptive divergence might be caused between the two groups of Tianogogi annuari. To identify local and under divergence selection, we perform two outlay analysis. As a result, many outlier loci were identified, and these loci are possibly under divergent selection. Genomic location of these loci will be the next challenge. <coughs> next, genomic status of the target population. We include four populations around the Taro hybrid population and detected 1, 000, about 1,003 loci. We perform two clustering analysis using admixture and fast structure, and they show similar results. I show here admixture results. Assuming two clusters, that two groups were assigned to different clusters, as previous studies suggested, and considerable admixture was detected in the total population. Assuming two clusters, although microsatellite DNA suggested various, various level of admixture, but large markers suggested that all individuals of the Taro population have the genome of both groups at the ratio of about 50%. And surrounding population show less than 10% genomic admixture. Assuming two, uh, three or more clusters, the Taro population was assigned different clusters. So this result suggests that the Taro population has different genetic composition, even though this population locates only 50 kilometers away from the surrounding population. To infer the genomic status of the Taro highway population, we estimate interpopulation heterozygosity, which is the proportion of the genome with alleles of both parental populations. If hybrid, F1 hybrid, plotted here, because they have, they should have a 0.5 hybrid index and also be all heterozygous at all loci. And Below this dash, uh, above this dash line, it shows habit form where back loads occur. Conversely, if be, uh, plotted below this dash line, it shows stable hybrid population because many loci were fixed by alleles of either group, either group over time. I use these two populations as parental population and plotted here. As a result, interpopulation heterozygosity of the Taro population was 30% uh, little variation. So individual of the Taro population are homozygous of either group at many low sites. And this is stable hybrid population. To infer excess and uh, to infer uh, to the low side uh, shows excess ancestry, we perform Bayesian clustering and uh, uh, Bayesian genomic prime analysis. As a result, the level of genomic admixture of 60% low side differ from the average admixture level. This results adaptive integration, genomic incompatibility, and genetic drift possibly affected. 
regarding to the adaptive integration, the taro is localized and uh, characterized by low temperature because of the effect of cold oasial current. So this specific environment may be related to the generation of the stable hybrid population. I would like to talk, uh, summarize my talk. Genome-wide divergence between the two groups was suggested. And several loci are possible to be under divergent selection. Our study suggests hybridization has generated a stable hybrid population with novel gen gen genomic composition. This population may be reproductively isolated from parental groups. So in the future, I focus on the isolation mechanism of this hybrid population. Thank you very much for your attention. That the two populations are reproductively isolated? Uh, now they hybridize. Uh, I don't know uh, because uh, there is hybrid population, so uh, they are not reproductively isolated by isolation. But now I don't know they are reproductively. Uh, so, in the future, I, 